Hi everybody, this is a video for all sixth grade and I'm going to introduce you to the Smart Music program today and show you the method book that I think we'll start using once we get things underway. The method book we're going to use to get ourselves started, whether you're experienced or a beginner, is called String Basics Book One. The reason that I chose this book is because it gives you really fun, interesting things to play along to while you learn the music. So the first thing I'm going to do is show you how to find it. I'm going to go back to my home screen. And the way that we find this book is actually pretty easy. You can search it here in the top right corner where it says search music content. But if you scroll down, you actually have all of these different categories that you can search. And method books is the biggest one, that big blue box. I'm going to click on that. Now, there are a lot of different method books here, but what we're going to do to make it easier is I'm scrolling down to where it says instruments, and I'm going to get rid of uh, this thing, show you the drop down menu here. Now, what we have to do is use our arrow, go down to where it says violin, viola, and cello, and bass. And what that'll do is that'll get rid of a bunch of these method books and, and give you less options so that you don't have so many to look through. You have to go down pretty far. So there's violin, viola, cello, and bass. So I went to method books and then I looked for instrument. I'll just choose violin. And now it only gives me two pages of method books. And if you look here, there's a bunch of different titles. We're going to go to the second page. And then there are three titles that stay string basics, book one, book two, and book three. The very most basic stuff is here. The more elaborate stuff is here. I'm going to go to book three, and I'll talk about the beginning stuff with the beginning class later. But for those of you that are experienced, let's start with the D major scale, which is the first thing on book three. So we're going to open that up. And what it'll ask you is which instrument. If it doesn't let you do it like it's not allowing me right now, you can refresh it right there and then choose an instrument. You can choose violin, viola, cello, or bass, and it'll show you that part. But if you choose violin, it's going to, oh, never mind. It doesn't ask you for violin, violin one, and violin two here. So you don't have to worry about that. And you press open. In the uh, other pieces, the orchestral pieces, it asks you for violin one, violin two. And what you see here is a whole D major exercise. So rather than a scale, this is a practice piece on D major, and this is for the experienced students to play around with. What's really cool is you can change the tempo, you can add the accompaniment, you can hear your part only, and I'll go over all of these things in the live session, but let's hear what this sounds like. Now that is pretty fast. What you can do is slow it down. I'll show you how to do that just in case that's not clear on the video. So I'm going to start over at a slower tempo, but you have to just go ahead and press where you want it to start from again. And here it is. Counts you off and it goes slower this time. Now remember, you can also take away that really fun accompaniment and just hear your part, even with a metronome if you'd like. Here's that, your part with a metronome. Good, so let's go back and just see where we were. Now the String Basics One book is great for beginners. This will actually show you really basic things like open D string and quarter rest, the open A string and quarter rest, both D and A together. So the beginners are gonna wanna start on String Basics book one. Right now I'm just gonna go ahead and refresh how we did that. We went to the drop down, uh, uh, drop down to these menus here, we go to method books. We go over to the left side here and scroll down to instruments and we get the instrument we want. Um, that's not, I didn't want oboe. So as you can see, it could be a little temperamental. I'll use my arrow this time. A lot of different instruments. So we got to scroll past those. And then there's violin or viola or cello, whichever one you want. And then we have our two pages, and there they are. String Basics Book 1, that's for beginners. String Basics Book 3, that's for the experienced class that's in Specials 2. But of course, if that's a little bit too much, you can always go to String Basics Book 2 as a medium uh, 
you know, as a, a something in the middle to prepare you. That's going to be it. Just a little introduction to smart music. We're going to talk all about this and get your account set up today. So I'll see you later, sixth grade.